Hello and welcome to my install video for Carbon ROM. Please see the links below for the location of the gaps and for the ROM that you're going to need to download to install this. Also note that I am doing this on the newest version of Twerp for the LG G2 D800. This is version 2.7.0.0. So first of all you want to make a backup. I already did that. You'll see here I have three backups actually. You're going to go to Wipe, Advanced Wipe, Dalvik, System, Data, and Cache. This is pretty quick, at least it has been on previous versions of Twerp. And doesn't disappoint here. We go back, we go back, and just for giggles, because we're here and it takes virtually no time at all, we wiped again. Install. Now we're going to find our carbon. I'm installing the 3.9 nightly. There is a 3.10 out as well. Add another zip. Find your gaps. Now I'm going to give you two links. One is for the gaps that I'm using, which is the uh, Paranoid Android Gaps Mini Modular from March 7th. And the other I will give you is for SlimCat Gaps, uh, which are TRDS compatible. So this shouldn't take very much time at all. I'll actually let this video run through while it's doing this. And uh, I will tell you that I do have a backup already of this ROM uh, that I used to do the review. However, I was waiting for my camera to get here before I did any more videos. So I'm now I'm backtracking. So there you go. Pretty quick install. We'll hit reboot. Take note that uh, once this does get booted up, give it a good 10 minutes before you do anything with it. So here it comes. And there's your boot animation. So I'm going to pause this while that is going on. So here we go. We're going to play here. It's going to search for Wi-Fi. So here we go. Skipping through, skipping through, skipping through. We're going to use Google Now Launcher. So here you go. This is what it looks like from a fresh install. Now let's go through the settings for this ROM right quick. All your customizations are going to be located here. Well, most of your customizations are going to be located here in Carbon Fibers. So we go to Buttons. <clears throat> You'll see Keyboard, Cursor Control, Playback Control, Reorientate, and of course, I always enable Volume Button to Wake. Get your device turntables, color calibration, I don't mess with. Vibration Intensity. Interface. You got your CRT animation, so you can see how you want to uh, turn off. List View Animations. Expand the desktop. Recents panel, where do you want your um, clear all position button to be? Lock screen. Got your active display. You can turn that on. Buttons has nothing general. Eight slider targets, shortcuts, theme style. What's theme style? Here it is. Got your lock handle icon. Notifications, you got your lock screen notifications here, pocket mode, uh, show always, hide low priorities, hide non-clearables. You can exclude certain applications, you can offset it. Uh, notification count, privacy mode, expand notifications, force expanded view, targets, one, two, three, four. So you get four if you don't enable the eight. One, two, three, four. So you get four if you don't enable the eight, okay? Navigation bar, you can you can have your navigation bar enabled. You can change the buttons. And that actually works. Oh, okay. You got your ring targets. 
your dimensions so we can lower the height. Menu visibility, menu location, show landscape mode. You've got your Pi. There's Pi. You can enable Pi. You can customize the first layer, the second layer buttons. You can do the style and dimension. There you go. There's an example of Pi. Does it work? Yes. Menu visibility. So there's your Pi. Power menu, this is exactly what you expect it to be. You can, what do you want to see in your power menu? You there you go. All right. Now, status bar, there you go. Battery icon, dotted circle with percent or percent circle, there you go. Colors, you can change the colors. Here's your clock. General settings, double tap to sleep. Notification drawer. Quick settings. can change the style, the number of tiles, tiles and layout. All right. So here are the options you get for the tiles. Camera, carbon, go to sleep, immersive mode, lock screen LT, music playback, NFC, orientation, performance profile, profile, quiet hours, screenshot, sound sync, volume, Wi-Fi, AP. We'll do that just for the heck of it. All right. So that's all your customizations here. Let's see what's in the display and settings. Ah, this is where you'll find your double tap to wake. So just make sure that's enabled. Let's check and see if it works. It does. And so does double tap to sleep from the lock screen. So that's the install video. Hope you enjoy Carbon ROM.